नमस्ते एवरी वन आई एम प्रिया पाठारे टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी सिंपल वे टू पेंट वन स्टॉक रोज फॉर दिस रोज आई यूज अ जीरो नंबर ब्रश एंड अ साइज सिक्स नंबर फ्लैट ब्रश एंड आई विल बी यूजिंग रेड व्हाइट फॉर द रोज एंड लाइट एंड डार्कर ग्रीन फॉर द लीव्स बिफोर यू स्टार्ट पेंटिंग यू कैन अरेंज द पेंट्स एंड ब्रशेज You need in a box for just keep them on the side so you save time searching for them I have taken this round stone you can choose any stone you have but it should have a smooth surface I am painting the stone with black as the base and let it dry I mostly use a dryer to fasten up the drying process I will be first showing the rose on paper step by step and then on the stone. Now I am taking the paints for the rose. The red paints has the perfect consistency but the white is much thicker. When choosing your brush use a brush which isn't much thick or thin. Now first clean your brush in water and remove the excess water. Load your brush with white on one side and red on the other and blend it. As I mentioned that the white paint is thicker so I am adding a drop of water and blending with it. I am painting the rose with 5 petals. You can paint 6 as well, but there should be 5 at least. Load your brush or add a bit of water whenever it feels needed. I have repeated the strokes twice to make it appear more defined. When painting the inner petals, the outer ones should be completely dried. I would suggest one stroke beginners to follow a particular artist so it won't be confusing and learn the easy and basic strokes at first. and uh, gradually move on to the complex ones you can practice your strokes by first drawing guidelines like this and painting over them these strokes are the four basic ones uh, for practicing one stroke roses Now I am painting on stone. I am first painting the leaves. The leaves are as much important as the rose itself. While reloading or adding water remember not to wash your brush in water just use a tissue uh, to wipe your brush and then reload it When painting on a dark base keep the lighter color on the outside 
so the leaves or rose pops out keep practicing guys practice make us perfect when i started one stroke i too faced problems but i kept practicing and realized uh, where my mistake were if you have any queries you can ask them in the comments I painted the strokes twice to make it appear more defined. I painted a circle with red as a base for the rose. I am painting this rose with six petals. Watch the video till the end and follow the steps. I hope you like this video. If you like it, don't forget to like, comment, and share.